condolences with the words expressed by one of our stalwarts that in the life of every nation there arise men who lived an indelible and eternal stamp on the history of their people. Men who are both products and makers of history. And when they pass, they leave a vision of a new and a better life and the tools with which to win and build it. With deep sorrow and profound sense of loss, the Afghan National Congress received the sad news of the passing of our Andre, former President Comrade Nelson Kholchata Mandela. Our nation has lost a colossus, an epitome of, hu of humility, equality, justice, peace, and the hope of millions here and abroad. Madiba loves South Africa. We recall the strength of his fist punching the air, has stepped out of the prison after 27 years, his tenderness during the negotiations for the freedom of our beloved country. We celebrate his ever-present smile, the cheerful Madiba jive, his love for children, and great respect for the women of this country. The large African Boabab, who love Africa as much as love South Africa, has fallen, is strunk and seeds, will, fly, will nourish the earth for decades to come. Nelson Mandela is Twalandwe born in the village of Kunu, in the Estual Bandustan of the Transkai, recognized the burden of colonial and racial oppression and exploitation. He loved the ANC, hence his frequent word that upon his death, he would join the nearest branch of the ANC in heaven. In his lifetime of struggle through the Afghan National Congress, he assumed and was assigned various leadership positions. He served with distinction. He was part of the ANC Leadership Collective and did not make decisions without first reflecting with his comrades, yet he would fight for the principle of what was the right thing to do. He worked tirelessly for the ANC and a free South Africa. He hated racism and bigotry, sought to a united, non-racial, non-sexist and democratic society where all are equal. To the entire family of Mandela, we extend our heartfelt condolences. Uh, he was as much yours as he was ours. Probably his dedication to the ANC family robbed you of a father. He, we will, for this minute on, as always, walk this journey with you to the end. To his friends in the ANC and across the globe and across all divide, be comforted. To the people of South Africa, May your hearts be not in distress. He lives in each and every one of you and in your homes because he gave himself to all of us.